this, a, this is an example of some of the, the technologies that we do for 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 imaging. This is the CT, and this is the M MRI, and so we fuse them, and uh, we register the images. That's that blending of technology, Ben, where I said he's taking this type of scan, this kind of, it's like layer them together, and then the computer combines all of it together for a great accurate target. Okay. So, so I'm, ju I'm just going to turn off everything but the lesion. And so, okay, so the lesion's down here, and I'm going to turn off the exodus lines. So you can see where the lesion is. So this is, uh, for example, if you're going to treat it with, be treated with gamma knife, this would be an a example of a lesion that, where they would put a frame on, head frame on, and they would do only one treatment. And what is, what is a gamma knife? A gamma knife is an uh, uh, arrangement of cobalt sources mm -hmm. that are all focused on one, they're in collimators, so they're all focused in one location. So it's, uh, it's the technology that preceded this, basically. But it's so, basically dedicated just for the brain, though, John? It's, it's just a, dedicated for a brain. And this particular lesion, it would not be able to hit because it's too low in the skull. And was that done in the operating room, or was that done in a, in a facility It like was this? done in a f facility like this. Okay. So it, there, there are gamma knife facilities. Mm -hmm. But you can see that the, the lesion is low in the brain. Mm -hmm. Now, if we look at the MRI, I'm going to turn the side off. You can see that it images quite well on the MRI. So you could really see that the blood brain barrier is compromised by this lesion because it's, it's being lit up. But if you go to the CT, you could barely see it.